guys, in this episode we are gonna explore Burj Hamoud And I'm not gonna explore it alone I have a guest who's gonna be exploring it with me together Joy Tacides <laughs> is my friend also, is also a food blogger We're gonna be exploring together today Yay! <laughs> Okay, so we arrived for breakfast to Harut Bakery. Apparently, it's like a famous uh, bakery here in Burj Hamoud where people uh, have uh, breakfast. And we also gonna order something, I don't know what. Probably but traditional. Maybe we'll ask people what are yeah. they eating here and uh, like creeps <laughs> just stare at their food. Okay. Hello, 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 Joy wants to tell us what are we having today. اوكي دونك طلبنا فطاير جبنه فطاير سبانيا كزبره وجبنه وجبنه وحاجه تايم فور ذا تيست لايك ذا سيم ات ذا سيم تايم اوكي اي لايك ات اتس جود اتس كورياندر اند The spices are so nice. This one is good, but I prefer the other. I'm still not sure. I like the heart. Benny, round three. I like that they're really <laughs> generous. It's really good. Oh, they put a lot of yeah. ingredients. Yeah. Mm. It's very like um, fresh. Last one, Jibne. Mm. They're actually all good. This is my favorite. I think my favorite was the first one with the coriander. What do you call it in Arabic? Kasbara. Jibni Kasbara for me. I like the fact that it's full of cheese. Usually they don't mm. put that much. I think I would actually come back. It's good. <laughs> Okay, so we finished our breakfast now at Harut Bakery and... And now the real Burj Hamut experience started. We're gonna go to Arad Street in uh, Burj Hamut. It's like the main street where you have like the stores. Hey Joy, I have a question. Have you ever been to Burj Hamut before? Never. Just to Union Marks for drinks. I've been to Burj Hamut, also to Union Marks. Yeah, I've been twice. But I didn't explore it like fully. It's actually cool to explore like an area that we've never been before. Yeah, exactly. And it's like only five minutes from Ash yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Right? It's a different vibe from Ash That's for sure. But uh, it's it's very big neighborhood, so I think there are a lot of things to see. I think it's full of culture also. Okay, so we decided to ask someone in the store what can we see in Burj Hamoud? Because we want to see like maybe a church or something. What's like uh, the main thing to see here? <laughs> Maybe we should try the tahini bread. I think it's traditional Armenian. Okay. Okay, so we got the tahini bread. Yeah. Okay, let's try. Not bad. I like sweeter. Just sweet. Not too sweet. I mean too sweet. <laughs> So we're walking in this Arak street, it's less hectic as the other streets and there are a lot of stores, so I guess people go shopping here. We are now trying to find a very cute coffee shop, saw it online, so I hope we're gonna find it. You, you make, make all I, I, this I make yourself? Them, yes. Here, right? Yes. So we were walking on the street and we found a store where they make handmade juice. Imagine all this is handmade right here by what's your name? Bache. Bache? Yeah. By Bache. <laughs> and how long does it take to make like a, let's say uh, one yeah, year? Please have a time. Two hours or one hour each piece. Oh, no way. So two hours and you can do something like, like this. this. Yeah. And basically, like anyone can come to your store and say like, I want this design, and you like. Of, of, of 
make it uh, for them. Yes. So it's all customers, like you can come to the store, put any design you want and uh, wash it. We'll do it for you. Like, when did you start uh, creating jewelry? About 30 years. 30 years? Yes, I was wow. a jeweler and gold designer before. Wow, that's yeah. impressive. What's interesting to know that Arak Street is famous for shoe making. There are factories here, like the one behind me, and they produce shoes here, and then they sell it all over Lebanon to different kinds of stores. مرحبا فيكم اسمي هاجوب يا غلجان مصلحتي من سنه 68 جزادين السويني جلد نفس الوقت شاطيه بورتمونيه تصليحات جزادين من سنه 68 في المصلحه هذه مكسور بدنا نصلحه هلا لحتى نرجع نركبه من اول وجديد So this is the big street here in Bushamud where you can also buy a lot of gold Joy, do you want to buy some gold? No <laughs> My name is Serli Abdulian And you are the owner of this uh, place? Yes, Jewel Times We sell 18 karat gold and second-hand luxury watches And why in Bushamud there are so many jewelry stores? Um, because it's a jewelry hub and because all of the factories are mainly here So whatever you need you can get it done on the spot. Thank you. We found the coffee shop that I want to go to. Okay, so the coffee shop is called Yes, please guess. It's called the okay, coffee shop. <laughs> it's called the coffee shop. I think we are almost there. I think to still find this coffee shop where I already went all the ways possible <laughs> to find it. The Google Maps here are not like your best friend. Oof. We are a lot of walking. We walked like 20 steps. Now we're hungry. We want to go have lunch. We're going to Badger restaurant. It's a very authentic Armenian restaurant. Cute house. Hello. Thank you so much. <laughs> Let's rest. <laughs> <laughs> dessert and different kinds of kata because every region in Armenia they make different type of katas uh, round ones is it like a soup or it's a... like a soup like a okay. soup but you have uh, pieces of meat which are hung and as a finger the food the end of the food very good Cleaned and we eat it with lemon or vinegar and with spices. I have an Anastasia, another Anastasia. To live long life, a long life. What did you do? What is the secret? What I did to live with people. To live with people? What they ask, yes. I will respond to say in order to live a long life. I sang with them in choirs, different languages. Yes. You believe in peace and you... I, I believe if they believe in sentimental living with each other, we could find reasons to not the war. This is the secret. The you start singing. No. <laughs> the this is the secret. If when she is together, nervous, she sings. If uh, the environment doesn't let her sing loudly, she sings inside. <laughs> Bravo
so Joy, what uh, dishes did you like the most? I don't know how you pronounce them properly, but super rack is so good. And super rack. <laughs> and the menti also. Super crispy. Yeah. Those are my favorite items. I, I, I agree with you. Like the same and also each. I like each. Yeah, the each also has good. The spices are so good. Sure. Yeah. It's nice because it feels like if you're eating at home. Mm -hmm. Literally. The food is very oh homemade. God. This is the dessert that we were filming. They were preparing in the kitchen and now it's ready. So we're gonna all try it. Thank you. Yum. Mmm. Mm. It's good. It's nice with the nuts. We just finished our lunch at Badger. It was so nice. Yeah, the people were super welcoming. Yeah, you feel like you have lunch at someone's house exactly. with homemade food, great hospitality, very nice place. Now we're gonna try to find coffee shop. If we find. Because we still can't find it. But we are still not giving up. We really want coffee. After searching for a coffee shop, million years, Da, 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 da. But we didn't find the one we were looking for. Yeah, it's not the one it's we were another looking one. for. Yeah, the one we were looking for, I think it doesn't, doesn't exist. exist. <laughs> Somewhere in the middle of Borj Hamud, I think, close to the main street. It looks cute. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> Hello. One. Big spade. Big stuff. Good. No, it's all sugar free, by the way. It's good. Sachten. <laughs> Now the day is better. We still have one more place for food to visit. It's called Mano. It's famous for sujuk shawarma. We're gonna go to Mano. It's uh, kind of the most iconic place. In, I never tried it, by the in way. In Burj Hamoud, me too. But I know that everyone goes there for sujuk. Yeah. It's an Armenian famous like sausage with spices. Super crowded. It's super crowded. But uh, yeah, yeah, let's go. It's for you. You're eating the paper. Hi. <laughs> Nice because it's spicy. But it's kind of dry. Mm. I like, for example, the breakfast place more. Of course. Okay, now we want to go for drinks. It will be the best part of the day. <laughs> We're gonna go to Union Marks. We arrived now to Union Marks. It's not our first time here. No. We've both been before. Yeah, and we really love this place. It's definitely it's really nice. One of the best places in Burj Hamoud. I love the greenery here and uh, they have good drinks. Okay, I want to say something. So the interesting fact about Union Marks is that before it used to be a factory where they used to produce clothes, I think. They say that's why here in the design you see those machines. But then they turned it uh, into a cool uh, bar. It's an old cinema where they're gonna show like vintage movies. Every Wednesday. Every Wednesday. Every Wednesday. Come, watch a movie here one day. I'm not finished yet. Wow. Nice. Interesting fact. When I used to live in Russia, I used to play in the theater when I was younger. Yeah? Yeah. To be or not to be? This is the question. Everyone, please let's clap for Anastasia. No, it's Asur Bella Eid Wala Ashra Ala Sharjla. Pol Basal U Ensa Al Hasal. Pol Tum U Ensa Al Hum. Anastasia. Finishing our beautiful day in Burj Hamoud in Union Marks. We're super tired. I also want to thank uh, Joy for coming today with me to explore Burj Hamoud. It was a pleasure. We really enjoyed it. It was very fun. I, I loved exploring it. Uh, why do I have uh, two glasses? <laughs>
So in the end of every episode, I say a word of the day in Russian and you're gonna say it in French. Okay. So the word of the day today is friendship. In Russian, it's дружба. In French, it's amitié. Amitié? Amitié. Sartén so, pour amitié. Cheers to our friendship. Bon sartak. Santé. Santé. Santé à sartak. <laughs> Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel for the next episode and please guys let us know in the comments what was the best part of the Burj Hamu trip that you really loved. Au revoir! <laughs>